Our business model, I think, can safely be said to be outdated. We are arguably the last remaining uh, very large vertically integrated power utility in the world. So we are an anomaly. The world of energy has changed around us and we need to change along with it. And as we change and as we divisionalize, we will see uh, the operational and structural inefficiencies uh, become more apparent and we can then address those. Moving along to uh, the actions that we've taken and the alternative of doing nothing, um, if we don't fix our operational uh, stability, we will be on the red downward sloping curve, which will result uh, in poor governance, as we've seen, poor staff morale, Eskom will be unable to operate. Uh, we will require increased borrowings and increased support from the fiscus, which we know is going to be very challenging, particularly in a post-COVID-19 environment where the fiscus is going to be uh, very constrained. And eventually, we will have severe restrictions and curtailments imposed on us from an operational perspective, which will translate into uh, lower availability uh, of electricity to the South African economy, which of course is completely unacceptable. We have, are therefore uh, developing plans to address our operational stability, to improve our income statement, to address our balance sheet, and to continue on the journey that we've embarked on to restructure and divisionalize our operations, uh, all the while improving the culture and motivation of our people who are so critical in enabling us to be a successful organization.